So hello guys, I am Apala Gupta and today we are solve a problem, uh, Java program, we are for the array, but there is a one twist. First array in ascending order and second array in a descending order. So how can we solve it, right? So there is, I take up an array. I, there's, I initialize one array. This is basically our array, right? So what we are doing here? Firstly, uh, there is a 10 values. What is there is a 10 value? So we are simply, we are 5 value. We are sort of 5 value in a ascending order, right? We are sort of 5 value in ascending order. And we are sort of 5 values in a descending order, right? So how can we do this? We are know that n equal to n by 2 plus n by 2. So this is simply a, a branch, right? We can simply do this so how can we do this we are doing a 0 to n by 2 we solve a sorting uh, techniques apply in a 0 to n by 2 in ascending order and now n by 2 2 now n by 2 2 n in a descending order suppose this is our n values right and there is a 1 2 3 4 5 and this is our n by 2 value right this is our n by 2 value right so what can we do? 0 to n by 2, we are doing a ascending order. And n by 2 to n, we are doing in a descending order, right? So this is basically our logic, right? So now we are implement it, right? So now we are going to implement it. So there is, I already initialize uh, my file with the sort.java. So here I already initialize my array and I stored my array plan in a n variable, right? So what can I do? Firstly, I initialize my loop in a i equal to 0 to n, right? And basically, I increment in a 1, right? So, what can I do? Firstly, I want to, I want to 0, 2, 0, 2, n by 2. Now, z plus, plus okay. And now, I initialize. J equal to n by 2, 2, j, 2, n, and now j plus plus, right? So this is basically our log. Now we are simply swap the values and so we are check in ascending order. In ascending order, our the array of j is not greater than of array of j plus 1. So, this is basically our logic. If we are getting the this type of this type of condition, so we are simply swap these values. This is basically our question. So, we are if our array of j, if our array of j value is greater than of array of j plus one value so we are simply swap it so how can we swap it so we are is uh, we are initialize here a one temporary variable right we are simply and uh, and i store my array of j value in it right and in a array of j value i store my array of j plus one value, right? And in our array of j plus one value, I want to store my temper value, right? So this is basically our logic. And we are simply here, what can I do? If our array of j value, if our if our array of j value is less than of array of j plus value, so we are simply doing this. Basically, this logics are vice versa logic we are applying here, right? So, we are checking the condition if our array of j value is lesser than of array of j plus 1 value. So, we are simply swiping. So, here I also am also initialize my temporary variable and 
I store my array j value in a temporary variable and in a array of j value, I simply store my array of j plus 1 value and in a array of j plus 1 value, I simply I simply apply my temporary value. So this is basically our logic. Now we are printing our array. Right, so I simply print my value here. In the arrays to the string one. So I pass my array on here. Okay. I run this my code, right? What has come here? I hope it's correct. Catch it. Says me no sorry. Okay, so we are checking it what's going wrong in here. There's a, some problem occurs. So we will we will check what is problems occur on here. What we are doing here, right? We are here in each slide the end number, right? So when we comes in a nth, right? So it is basically give up, right? So it is basically goes in a seventh length, right? So this is basically we are initialize there n minus one because when our words iterator in a n minus one, so this is swept here a n minus one to n, right? So when we goes in a n, we are declaring here, here in a n, right? So this is n plus one. So that's why the problem is occurred. So now we are run our code. Now we are run a code. I think it's what right. So this is basically work four five six nine, and here this is in a descending order nine six one right. So this is basically our logic, and I hope you all are enjoy and understand what is our logic. So thank you so much, all of you guys. Thank you. So Thank you.